Hi everyone, this is a tutorial on how to draw a shibi boy holding a soccer ball. At the end of this video, I am going to add a bonus drawing of what this shibi is thinking, so please stick around if you want to see that. So we're going to start with the head. We're going to start by drawing a circle. It doesn't have to be a perfect circle. We can adjust the little mistakes later. Then after we draw the circle, we're going to add a little curved line right here to start making the shape of the shibi's sheep. And adjust the shape like this. Now we're going to start to draw the guidelines. And we're going to start to draw a little curved line for the eyes. It's not too curved, just a little bit kind of curved and kind of straight. And draw that same curved, kind of curved, kind of straight line for the other eye. Then we're gonna draw, start drawing the eye. Then we're gonna draw like an oval shape. And same for the other eye, but we're gonna make the other eye bit longer in this eye for it can be at an angle and we can erase as needed and we're just going to put a little line at the bottom like this uh, a little smaller line though Now we're going to make a line for the nose and a small smile, kind of like that, but a little bit lower than that, but also a little bit higher than that, around right there. And now we're going to start doing the hair. We're going to add a little curve on this part for the hair and up to around there and make the hair go up a little then we're about to do the hair again around there and make it go up again just like that then we're gonna make the another curved line around the end right there to make that strand just like that now we're going to do the other strand of hair we're gonna make a curve right there kind of round it off, make it kind of round, and then go down, kind of like that. Now we're going to do another curve around right here, and make, make it go down up to like right there. Now we're going to go up again, up to right there, and make a few adjustments to that, make it look a bit better. And now we're going to continue from this line and go a bit more down up to, let's say, right here. Then around right there, we're going to start doing the ear. Well, actually, no, we're going to start doing the ear right here, just a little circle. And we're going to erase this line right here. And we're going to make this line go down from here up to right there. Then we're going to erase this headline right there and make it a bit rounder. To right there, I would say. And now we're going to go here and do a little line right here. But a smaller line. And do the same thing over here to make a smaller line right there. And we're going to make this a bit more curved. We're going to make this a bit more even like that. And now we're going to go 
over here to the back of the ear and continue doing the hair just like that. Or make the hair that length and do one more strand of hair right there. And adjust the face, making it a bit more round. Shaping out the face a bit more. And maybe just adjust the smile one more time. There we go. And maybe just make this eye a little bit shorter for it can be at a right angle. There we go, just like that. Now we are going to start drawing the neck. And the neck is just two straight lines that are parallel to each other. Now we're going to start drawing the shoulder just like around. You just go round like that. It's very round. And the elbows, like, let's we'll say the elbows around there. Then we're going to start drawing the other shoulder. Just curve it like that. And I, the arm's gonna be up to here, let's say that around there. And let's say the other arm's gonna be over here, like that. Now we're gonna draw a line for right here and a line right here. Well, not right there. <laughs> Make the arm a bit like smaller. And make the line right there. Now I would say we're gonna draw the jacket so up to here, like a curved line here for the jacket and then curve it here again for the other side of the jacket and then right here we'll put a line right here and we make a curved line right here too for a little decoration on the jacket and another curved line right here And after that, we're gonna make a straight line right here. And now we're gonna start doing the pants, just a straight line, a little bit shorter than that. Then another straight line, but a horizontal one. And now we're gonna go back up. And another straight line right there. And another straight line here, but horizontal. And we're gonna go straight back up again. And we're going to draw pockets right here. Now for this arm, we're going to draw a little circle, cur circle, circular motion curve line right there. And do another one, like a rectangle shape right there. But a smaller one, kind of like that. And make this, the ends of the jacket sleeve a little more round and just do a round shape for the hand right there now we're making jacket a little bit bigger just like that and we're gonna add a little crease marks for the jacket right there and we're going to get the sleeve and and round it off a bit more We're still gonna draw a rectangle right there, but smaller, somewhat smaller. And the hand's gonna be drawn up to some round shape for the hand right there. And right here, underneath the arm, we're gonna draw a soccer ball. Just a curved shape there and a curved shape there. Now for the soccer ball right here, we're gonna do a little rectangle because soccer balls have rectangles there. All we had to do is do two lines here and one straight line there. And do a straight line here to make it look like a soccer ball. Then another line there. Then one more line here, I would say. Mm. Make a few adjustments.
Okay, now we're done with the ball. Now we're gonna do the shoes. Straight. We're gonna do a straight line going down right there, but kind of slanted. Now we're gonna do a straight line here, and another straight line right here, make it look like a rectangle, kind of slanted in one direction. Then we're gonna make the bottom of the pants a little circular curve like that. And we're gonna do the other shoe, just a little bit like that, slanted line, another straight line. Then make the line, the very bottom of the shoe, a bit curved like that. And now we're gonna go to this pan and round off those rectangle lines. And do a few lines right here to make it look like it's fabric. And do the same thing for the jacket over here. Make these this rectangle a bit more circle, look like a circular, round it off. And make it look like fabric with these lines. And now we're gonna dress the hair just a bit more. Not too much, just a bit. Erase this part of the ear. Draw pupils inside the eyes. And now we're gonna outline that with this outliner. I'm gonna fast forward this part. Now we are going to draw what this shibi is thinking. And I am going to fast forward this part. So this shibi was thinking about making a soccer goal, but he really likes soccer. Now, please don't forget to subscribe if you like this video and please check out the next video that I'll be uploading soon. It, it's going to be about me coloring this chibi. And in the meantime, if you want to learn how to draw an alien chibi, please click on this video.